Hi guys, this is Cobra Tom. And I'm Lily. And we're doing, um, I'm not sure what you call this, a dolly, I suppose. This dolly was made by one of the girls from The Finest. She bought this for 25 And they didn't have any at the time when we were ready to buy it. And they weren't sure if they were going to have they enough. They had the sailor Shipwreck. Shipwreck, yeah. So, we asked if they could. And she was making it right then, and I asked which one she was making, she said theirs, and I said, ooh, cool. So, then we decided to shop and look around a little bit and wait till it was done. Mm -hmm. So, why don't you give, this one's going to be a bit of a short one, but it's still a Joe Fest purchase, and it's still pretty you cool. You can also reverse her a little bit. Her hair looks a little weird reversed because it's smaller in the back, but... Hair. The hair is a bit of an issue sometimes. Also, give her dreadlocks. Okay. Well, one of the things that happened is we were off getting some pictures done. <laughs> and we're standing there and we're doing our Iron Grenadier. We had our matching Iron Grenadier shirts. We had our cool background with... Oh, I found my Joe shirt. Good. She couldn't find her Joe shirt, so I had to wear mine and not have somebody mm -hmm. match me. But that's okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, we were taking our pictures, and I set it down to take the picture and stuff. And um, we left and stuff. Also, I got a necklace in my suitcase. I didn't want to lose it. And um, I bought it and then we just left. And then almost an hour later, we I almost run back and I'm like, I forgot um, my doll here. And she's like, oh yeah, I remember you. And she gave my doll back. Yeah. Why don't you go get your necklace quick? I'll, I'll talk about this just for a moment. The Baroness was never even supposed to be a recurring character. She was supposed to be in... Um, the first one, she was supposed to be this sneaky spy person, like she ended up being. And she was supposed to just be a one-off, but she was so popular that they had to bring her back. And everybody seemed to like her so much that then in 1984, even though she is in, I believe she's in the first issue of the comics, um, they make some kind of comment like, if... If you think she's dead, you better stand 10 feet back or otherwise there's going to be a grenade. She might even have a grenade to go off if she's dead and all that kind of stuff. And she's sneaky and devious and she's got a relationship with Destro and all that. And that's pretty cool. She um, has glasses, but of course, you know, with a... a a doll like this you're not going to be able to get glasses on it but you do see that they kind of did a cobra symbol on it that's pretty neat with a uh, st string doll that they made it's pretty cool I do like that she at the moment can't find her I'll find it in some other video I'll show you later. why don't you I'll, I'll, I'll look a minute. Why don't you yeah. talk about this for a minute? I'll help you look. Okay. Um, she has a, I'm not sure if I covered this, but she has a logo right here. And it's supposed to be the Cobra logo. Um, and she is full of stuffing. You can kind of see the stuffing on the top of her head. It's hard to see. Um... She is a very cool -er doll. And here's the necklace I got. What was it? It was on the blue box. Mm. I thought I left it on the brown table to go to sleep. No. Hmm. But there it is. We bought that from somebody who was, I'm not even sure from that area, was a 
a dealer, but knew where Wisconsin was because she had family in Wisconsin. So she knew about where we lived. So that was pretty cool. I'm Doing going to hypnotize you. Oh, I'm That's hypnotized. Awesome. I accidentally wore this in the pool, and thank goodness it did not get like anything on it from the chlorine. Ah, that's right. So, that is really cool. She bought that at pretty, well, not the exact same time, but same day, same time-ish that she bought that, and we got the pictures taken. There was a side room where you could um, buy. It, it was down. upside down. Non-Joe stuff, actually, was in one of the rooms was kind of just pictures and that's where this we giant also, base that was a hundred dollars and you only got you got the instructions and like three wood pellets yeah you didn't even get i was so confused i thought it was like a hundred dollars for this giant base that looked awesome but you had to make it yeah and in that same place she was able to buy her monster people one that grandma's Show her that. Car. We're going to do, this is just going to be a mixture review and I will be right back with the other one. You talk about that one, I'll be right there. This is a, like, I don't know what to call it. I'm not even sure what they're called. But it has a purple side with the mouth and um, eyes and it looks like it's like bubbling and about to die or something. I'm sad that the mouths don't connect because the mouth connects to the eyes and goes all the way around to the mouth. But then there's this zombie side with red eyes, so it looks like he's mad, and a big yellow teeth. I don't know, it's mostly it to talk about. Um, he does have these weird bumps up here and some cracks in him. That That's what it's supposed to look like because I'm not sure. But if I color up, cover up all the purple, it looks kind of cool. Oh, you can't see. Oh. Okay. The bouncy ball. We also um, took The, we also got this guy because it was five dollars and I think two dollars for the other guy The purple and green dude this eyeball was five Yep We put him in the pool so he was outside Yep, and he was fun and if you saw our fun pool video Which if you haven't go check it out We tested if a bunch of stuff floated and some did some didn't that floated pretty well we didn't try this. We just we like I tried to slam it on the water, and it just came popping right back up, like really fast. Yep. And we learned something new. That baseballs can sink in water, even though we thought it was going to no, stay up. No, no, no. We thought it was going to sink, and it floated. Until and then later, we couldn't find him. I don't know. We called. We named it Basie. We named it Basie. Yeah. And we kept like. We we did like this thing that we I called the Zoyberg from Futurama. Yep. And yeah, that didn't really work. And then Dad found it, and then he found it three times after that because I tried to hit a ship with the ball. Yeah, we were playing with him. And then I finally found it the last time because I was reckless and I dropped it again. Yep. So that's our review. This. This one is kind of a weird miscellaneous one of a bunch of stuff that we bought, but it's still pretty cool and everything went real good, so. It's not even coloring the camera. Nope. Here's our Joe Fest band. Dressing. Oh yes, that's our Joe Fest band. She got to wear. You and needed it to get inside. I let dad in with. Yes. Which is really weird because we were standing in line and the whole line, we didn't even have to stand in. We had our thing already. We didn't even know it until I, I actually... And we were all the way in 
the back of the line, like all the way through the hotel, and then we realized, oh my gosh, we already did this. We could have went all the way in. We could have just went in right away, but oh well, that's okay. So, thank you for watching. This one was fun. We got to do a few things that we got. This was more just purchase Joe Fest purchases than a specific thing, but that aren't really like yeah. action figures. Yeah, and she got a whole bunch of nice little action figures that will get their own review. I got a bunch of slugs for a thing that I'm doing. Yeah, and she got this cool frag viper. Didn't you get that? What did I get? I got that. I got that because you were gonna pick out um, another guy and that we already had, so we didn't get a Baymax though. So. But okay. yeah, but she got um, a slug. She got like three or four slugs, and she got this guy for seven dollars, which is a nice figure. The um, Techno Viper. Those will be getting their own review. I do actually have one with all of its stuff, but you can never have too many of these guys. These guys are pretty cool. And you can never have too many of these guys. These are really cool. So, well, thank you for watching, and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.